Hey guys, it's the unboxing channel again. Now I brought you some more specific stuff than usual, more electrical engineering topic. This is the unboxing video of the brand new Rigor programmable DC power supply, the DP932U type. This is their newest power supply out in the market now. It has got three outputs. Uh, the first two can be adjusted between 0 and 32 volts in voltage and uh, 0 to 3, uh, 3 amperes in current. The third channel can be set between 0 and 6 volts in voltage and uh, 0 to 3 amperes in current. So that means that the power supply is capable of uh, outputting 210 watts total power. The three channels are completely independent, but uh, the first two channels can be serial or parallel connected by software, so no external cable needed, but if you prefer that, it's also possible. You can set different waveforms to output, both in voltage and in current manner. There are even preset waveforms built into this device, uh, there is a user, user interface for it, so it's pretty intelligent. I will show you it uh, in the review video later. It has got a 4.3 inch color touch LCD display or screen. It has got a low output ripple and noise. It's uh, less than 350 microvolt uh, RMS per 2 millivolt peak to peak. It's the U model, so it's designed to universities with safety sockets on it, uh, not the usual banana plugs you find on other power supply units you will see. But now let's see what's inside the box. I cut it open. we go. There is a calibration certificate documentation. You can see uh, what devices they use to calibrate and uh, what the result is when they are calibrated it and you also got uh, three spare fuses. Uh, it's the, uh, the glass uh, fuses. Okay you got uh, an USB cable for connecting the device to the computer the device can be also controlled and programmed from your PC using SCPI protocol. You should download the Ultra Sigma software from Rigol's website. I will also show it to you in the review video. You have uh, two ways to connect to the PC. One is the USB cable and the other is the Ethernet cable. We got two sets of cable, two sets of cables. One side is banana plug and the other is uh, crocodile plug. It's uh, nicely isolated so you can make sure that no electric shock will happen. It's a uh, pretty good quality for the first side. So yeah, that's, that's cool. And finally you got the power cord for connecting uh, to the AC line. I got the EU version plug. Let's put it aside and now the device itself. It's not easy. It has got a weight so you can feel that it's, it's premium. The weight comes from the transistor probably. It's uh, nicely packaged, so you can make sure that it won't uh, be damaged during the shipping. It's also wrapped in plastic to, to avoid scratches. Cut this open. So let's start with the back side. So at the back side there are uh, the connectors, connectors which I told you previously. You got the Ethernet port, the USB, 
the IO port and uh, the USB host connector. Here you can set the AC voltage before connecting uh, it to the power. Uh, so make sure please that you set it correctly first, otherwise the unit can be damaged. You got a nice carrying step, so you can carry this uh, in your lap from one desk to another. It's a cool feature. It's yeah, it's it's usual, but but we got this. Uh, here is there are some ventilation grill for cooling, and uh, on the other side, uh, the cooling is also granted. And here is the front panel. Okay, as I told you, um, there are some special banana plugs, uh, safety sockets, there is also a USB host uh, port in the front and the power button, and the uh, 4.3 inch color touch LCD display, the selection buttons for the three channels, and the on-off buttons for them. There is a rotary switch for input data, you can use this to set voltage and current values, and around it there are uh, some numerical buttons if you prefer that uh, to set levels like that. By default, uh, this device can be controlled um, by 10 mV per 10 mA precision, but you can upgrade it to 1 mV per 1 mA precision if you buy the activation from Rigor's website. You got also over voltage, over current and over temperature protection uh, on the outputs built in. I will also make a review video as mentioned before for this device where I can show you the device more detailed on the functions and how to do this and this. Uh, this much could, f could uh, fit to this video. Thank you very much for watching and if you like my videos please subscribe to my channel. Thank you very much and uh, bye.